I just put a little pimple patch on. It's like little lips. They're little lips. They're really cute. I need to take my pill. I'm Orange Mia. In here. But I'm going to show you guys my outfit for tomorrow. Because I picked it out already. And it's very cute. The lighting's very bad. And I don't have my contacts in so I can barely see. Okay. I think we should be fine for now. White Converse. Not any... They're just like the normal ones. They're not the platforms or anything. And then I have these American Eagle extra long jeans. They just kind of like, they don't flare fully out, but they're really high waisted. Fit my waist pretty well. No rips. And they just barely flare out. Then this white under shirt, long sleeve because it's winter here and it's freezing cold. Oh my god, it was actually so cold outside today. I was like shivering all day at school. It was awful. They really need to crank the heat up. I feel like some days I'm either really sweaty at school or I'm really cold. There's just no in between or perfect temperature. And it's really frustrating because I just would like to be comfortable. But whatever. And then this um like crochet green knit sweater situation or like cardigan over shirt um from versona which i don't know if that's like a thing online what well, i'm assuming it is um or um like it's everywhere else but they have one here where i live so i sometimes go there and shop with my mom and they have some really cute finds so don't knock versona but i'm gonna go to bed i had a very long day i did two tests i had anatomy and math um, and I volunteered after school with my mom for her work, and we went around and picked little, like, Christmas gifts for people based off what they wanted and stuff. It was really cute, and I had a lot of fun. We were there for, like, four hours, and we had dinner there. We shopped there, met some new people. It was really good, and I love volunteering. I highly recommend volunteering because it's very fulfilling, and you feel so good after. I'm just, like... My heart's always so warm after volunteering, so I feel like if you need to, like, step back from your life and if you get, like, really overwhelmed or feel like you take things for granted, volunteering, I feel like, is a really good way to get out of that mindset and you just, like, realize that there's people that have it way worse. Obviously, not to invalidate your feelings, but just see other perspectives in other people's lives and realize how good you do have it and it's important to be grateful and help others so yeah I've been loving volunteering this year I mean I always have but I feel like I've really made it into my schedule looked for places like so yeah me and my mom did that for about four hours and then I came home chilled took a shower and I am going to sleep I edited yesterday's vlogmas and posted it on tiktok so if you don't follow my tiktok it's at Ileana James 11 it'll be on the screen too so you can go follow I do vlogmas every day of December on there and I need to just vlog more on there on TikTok in general but I do vlogmas every day of what I'm doing different formats different things different events different days um all the way up until Christmas and I'm vlogging on here but I feel like it's a very different content this is just more like random thoughts and that's like more random things i'm doing also this pimple patch is coming off no so adorable but i will catch you guys later bye, -bye. I ended up wearing the outfit i showed you yesterday that's how i'm gonna be able to show you it all and i just wore my hair just down and put on oh, i have my airpods and put on like jewelry and stuff but right now, I have a little time after school, and I want to do this, my voice, <clears throat> I want to do this because I kind of got this a little bit ago with a friend while I was at Target, and I have yet to start it, but I think it'll be really, really good. It's a journal, which I love journaling. I feel like I'm very on and off with it, though, and it says, I totally got this, a journal to remind myself that I'm truly 
awesome and capable that I'm seriously going to nail it no matter what it is and no matter how much I secretly doubt myself because doubt is just a four letter word. Okay, five. And how should I and how should doubt the doubt like the nonsense it is enchant I can do this I can do this over and over again while imagining myself landing in that new dream job or doing the things that scare me most or getting through my run without dying or surviving a blind date because if I believe I can do it or at least convince myself that I can I've got a darn good chance of actually killing it like the champ that I am after which I'll start wondering if I'll ever be able to do it again so yeah and there's a bunch of like prompts and daily stuff and I want to do it because I think it looks very cool. I'm gonna grab a pen and I'm gonna journal a little bit. I, I have this orange um, pen I love. Orange is my favorite color by the way. But this is just the orange Bic Gelosity 0.7 pen. And I use this like all the time in school and just when I'm writing. It's so fun and different. No one writes an orange pen, so I'm gonna do this journal and get back to you. So I'm very excited. Okay guys, I am gonna take off all my jewelry and hop in the shower because I have math tutoring tonight and on nights where I have later math tutoring, it's like 7.30 to 8.30 and then by the time I get home and I eat and like get my stuff ready, I just, the last thing I wanna do is take a shower and it's just really nice getting it out of the way. So, if I can, I try to shower before, and then I can just come home and just, like, after a long day, it's just really nice to not have to worry about that. So, that's what I've been doing. I'm going to pull up my hair in a bun because I do not wash my hair pretty much ever. I love these kitsch satin little hair ties. They're the best. There's like a fog on my phone. One second. I feel like that looks much better. Maybe not. Turn on the shower. Do my same body shower routine. And yeah, I'll see you guys in a little while over it. I just woke up from a nap and I'm like and I made myself some more coffee I think this creamer tastes weird like it has it kind of has a sour taste and I definitely liked it before so I'm gonna have to make another coffee or drink a Celsius, but that's besides the point. So, a little haul of what I got from volleyball. They gave us volleyball. Sick. It needs all blown up, obviously, but. And then. I got new knee pads. Yay, these look really small. I remember trying them on and they were small and I normally wear like the small medium and they were way too small. So I sized up 
then we got like a hoodie situation it's like a tight it's not like an actual hoodie it's like tighter and it looks really big and long so that'll be interesting then we got some black sweatpants just black sweats these are from i don't even know what brand this is but okay then we got some leggings <clears throat> yep just black adidas leggings I, think I... I got two pairs and then what else is in here for jerseys this is what my first one looks like the back cute and then the long sleeve one okay i like this one a lot this one's really cute and then i got backpack which i think i'm gonna switch all my stuff over from my school backpack into this one so yeah, then we also got these calendars that we have to sell to people to like fundraise. So I need to give this all to my mom. But yeah, that's everything I got from my club volleyball with gear. So that's fun. I need to go make myself a new coffee though, because I don't know. I don't know if I'm going crazy doesn't smell bad i don't know i just feel like something is telling me not to drink this so i'm trusting my gut with that but i'm gonna get ready oh by the way i have volleyball practice today so i'm gonna get ready and head to practice i'm very tired it's thursday night but it's time to get ready for practice so oh i also wore a really cute outfit to school today i had my hair up in a bun and i wore this romper and jean jacket some cute gold jewelry and my brown boots so yeah i only have one more day of school before winter break and hopefully i'll vlog tomorrow we're doing a dodgeball tournament and student council is putting it on so if i'm not too busy and like overwhelmed i'll try to get some vlog clips for you guys because that would be fun to document i'm very happy with all my new volleyball stuff this is fun getting new volleyball stuff is always fun i feel like getting new stuff is always fun but yeah hopefully it all fits i haven't tried it on looks like it should all fit fine but we'll see but i'm gonna get ready for practice tonight and then i'll see you guys also later but i'll see you tomorrow as well so let's do all my new club volleyball stuff for this season and so i'm going to move all my stuff from my school bag um to my club bag my school bag kind of holds like everything i feel like but my club bags don't i don't know how to describe it i'm gonna have to take off this tag later but here's my school bag so I have volleyball shoes. I'm gonna, what pocket? Whoops, I don't know what pocket I wanna put them in. Maybe, I don't know. This one, okay, I'm gonna put it in the back pocket. My shoes. Okay, and then these are the knee pads I have right now, just Nike ones, however, we got these new ones so i'm just gonna throw those in there um if i ever want to wear them i have inhalers i have a ton of biofreeze deodorant this bag full of stuff yeah i'm gonna okay so i have this like bag with my name on it that has tons of like essentials And then my actual inhaler that I use um, is in my school backpack. So whenever I go to volleyball, I just bring that one because these ones are kind of old. 
but I have Nike sleeves and Mizuno, which I don't really wear either of the, these because I'm not really on the ground and I feel like I get really hot really quickly in those, but a lot of like DSs or whatever. Sometimes I wear them, sometimes I don't. It's just depends if I feel like it or not. Okay, I'm gonna bring this, no, I'm gonna bring this Biofreeze and this deodorant and put it on this side. And then probably my inhaler would probably go in there or any other essentials. And then like my phone AirPods on any other one. Okay, that's my new volleyball bag. So I can pack this up for the season, I guess. I like all my things on here. I don't know, I might move them over, but for now I'm just gonna keep her clean. I need to take off the tag, but yay, I packed up that bag. So that's perfect.